Hi, this is Zia at Coffee Query. In this video, I want to show you how to upload file in uh, Laravel and Vue.js. Okay, let's start. I have already created my application, so if you have problem with that, please go to my previous video, uh, which is uh, Laravel and Vue.js CRUD operation. I have uh, pasted the link below and that will help you how to create a Laravel and Vue.js application. So yeah, I have created my application and I'm going to run it. CMD PHP artisan serve and we have another server for Vue.js CMD uh, npm run watch let them run and I will open the uh, application and VS code okay this is our application and if I go to the browser navigate to localhost 8000 <coughs> this is Laravel 8 uh, I have modified the landing page and I want to load Vue.js component right over here so that's why I have I have removed the extra codes here and just I want to load Vue.js component here yeah if you go to the resources GS component we have a default component uh, created here uh, example component this component is registered here in app.js here so what we're gonna do we copy this and go to the welcome.blade.php here we'll have a div with the id of uh, app here I will paste it Yeah. Hi from Vue.js. This one. So now our Vue.js component is loaded inside the blade template file. What we do, we create a form here. Form at submit dot prevent we call a function called submit so the form we have an input type is file at change we call a function on change another input type is submit the value is uh, upload okay let me check it yeah we can select the file Here we'll have a, a data property. Here I will define a variable, a property called image. It's method and inside method we have to will define two uh, functions on change
on change will accept a, 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 a parameter which is event coming from time when we select a file here I will uh, check console dot dot lock selected file okay. e dot target dot files of zero let me see if I if I get the file yeah perfect we got the file now we will assign this file to the image is equal to e dot target dot files Another method we define is submit. Here we use farm data to upload the file. Let fd is equal to new farm data. And now we'll, we'll call axius dot post the URL will be http localhost a thousand API API slash upload and we and, and the body will be FD then we will get a response just we will lock the response response dot data and if we get if our api return any error we will catch that here console.log here yeah we have we are done with the front end and let's go to the to our API before we define our route yeah PHP artisan make uh, controller and the controller name will be f uh, file file controller yeah yes our controller is created now if we go to the app HTTP controllers and file controllers uh, controller is created here now I will define the route we go to the API here I will write route post upload and our controller is inside the app HTTP controllers file controller will follow that app http uh, controllers and file controller okay and the method we will define inside the controller will be upload go to the controller uh, file controller here I will create my function public function upload a request and uh, 
yeah let's check if we can get here from the front end so return response return response is json message is okay yeah let me go to the browser and choose a file upload yeah we got the response okay and now we'll and now we'll yeah inside try catch block here I will first I will check if the file exists if request has file the name of the file should be uh, what is that it's uh, oh sorry before I send FD to the API I need to uh, append this image to the form data okay fd dot append name of the file is img in this dot image okay yeah image if the file exists then what we do we uh, store into a variable request file img yeah when we store the file into in in a folder we need we need to give a name we can have uh, our file can have its default name but we will give a new name for that okay file name is equal to i will use uh, here is we have a helper method time and we will concatenate with uh, with the file get client original name this uh, can be enough for 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 giving the name this is the original name that we uh, that uh, our file has uh, but sometimes you may upload the same file twice that may cause some problem but we will give a unique name for every upload so now what we do we will file move move the file into into public image folder so what we do public path and inside the public folder where we have uh, image folder and the second parameter will be the name of the file this one okay Yeah, this is uh, 
I think we are done with that. We will return a response. Response will be JSON format. Mm. Message is file uploaded success. That's good, 200. If something happened here, we'll catch it here. Catch. Uh, the general exception. Yeah, I think we are done. I hope it works without any error. Oh, strong. Call to undefined function app HTTP controllers public path oh sorry this is not correct public path let me try again to undefined function of controller response oh shit return response yeah file uploaded successfully let me confirm with you here inside the public folder yeah it's uh, two images so I plan to upload here but it's uploaded here why because this is if if this folder does exist it will up, uh, it will uh, upload the file inside that otherwise it will create a new folder images a new folder so let me check test okay if I go here yeah test our file is uploaded here okay thank you for watching if this video help you please subscribe to this channel and i will make more tutorials like this thank you bye